The sixth edition of the World Forum on Intercultural Dialogue took place in Baku, Azerbaijan at the beginning of May. Dialogue for Peace and Global Security, Cooperation and Interconnectivity was this year's topic. The event brought together policymakers, activists and scholars from around the world to discuss strategies for fostering mutual respect and understanding among diverse communities. Throughout the forum, participants engaged in a wide range of activities, from panel discussions on the role of education in promoting intercultural understanding to workshops on conflict resolution and peace building. For the first time, the role of artificial intelligence in cultural heritage was debated amongst the delegates. AI is a tool invented by people and developed by people. When we look at cultural heritage or heritage in general, I think that belongs to humanity. It is formed by human, it, it's lived through uh, people. I see AI as a tool that will help maybe to show it in a better way, to present it in a better way, but it will not take it from humans. I think that we are smart enough right now. I think it, we, we will develop with it. I think it has a, a future, but not a threat. Delegates from around the world are grappling with the impacts of climate change on cultural heritage sites and practices. From rising sea levels threatening coastal landmarks to extreme weather events endangering traditional practices, the need to protect our cultural heritage has never been more urgent. The main task of today's discussions is to uh, understand the problems may occur to cultural heritage in the face of climatic change and uh, to discuss possible ways of solutions and to find the best of them for all the countries. As the forum entered its final day, there was a palpable sense of optimism among participants that the discussions and initiatives launched here will contribute to a more harmonious and interconnected world. So this is the sixth World Forum for Intercultural Dialogue and it seeks to establish a clear relationship between culture and peace. The culture that you need to develop peaceful relations in our troubled world and the peace that you need in order to allow the culture to thrive. And yes, we've achieved our goal. After five years of waiting because of the pandemic, we've now launched in 2024 a milestone, a new initiative, a new inspiration and a new commitment to the future.